moving on to chapter five, which is about vertical perception. And this chapter is basically completely focused around Frederick's own personal ex experiments that he was trying himself as he was trying to test this out for himself and see if it was a real thing or not, or to see if he was capable of doing it at least. Um, he does highlight in the beginning how up until this point when he wrote the book, you know, as far as I know myself as of right now, you know, has never been proven to be a real solid, you know, like scientific, repeatable, concrete fact yet. Now, um, I know a lot of people out there will probably disagree with me saying that. Um, if anybody out there, by the way, has, you know, some study that they really like, I think is really solid, especially if it's kind of like a newer study that's come out, you know, in the more recent years or something like that, please send that to me. I would love to go ahead and dig into it some myself. But, you know, so he starts off with those ground rules being set where, you know, up until this point, and he was researching the topic for many years, you know, was never proven solidly enough for him to be like 100% on board with it, which is why, you know, he wanted to go ahead and test it out for himself. He does also highlight here right off the back in the beginning that he did have kind of like the, the, the belief that vertical perception was possible in one way or another. And I think that's particularly important to highlight before we kind of hop into the rest of this chapter, because I'm kind of uh, on the other end of that. Now, I leave the door open to possibility. I think it would be cool if it was possible. I think maybe even it is under like really special, you know, odd type of circumstances. Like, I don't think it's really possible to be done on command per se. So I'm kind of like, like on the opposite end of that. Like, I, I hope it's true. It would be kind of neat if it is, but I'm kind of on the side of, well, it's probably not true. So I'll kind of acknowledge that bias that I'm starting out with, you know, to begin with. But with that said, we'll go ahead and we'll hop into the rest of this chapter.